Welcome back to Real House DIY. Today we're taking a look at the Incra Miter 1000 SE Miter Gauge for your table saw. So you have the typical miter gauge that comes with your table saw. Not super precise, but gets the job done. Now this one I'll still use for most work. It's easy, it's right there on the table saw. When you don't need the super precision, you know, definitely just grab that. It's still good. This one I really like with the, the long fence. The fit is really tight. So you're gonna cross cut. You're gonna get your perfect 90 degree on that. Look a little closer. You can use this piece here. You can either hold down your wood, keep it from moving around too much, or it goes all the way down and it's a stop. So making multiple cross cuts on the same piece of wood, you can make them the exact same width. You have your adjustment here so you can slide that left or right. Right here is where you're going to adjust it. You can see I have it set on zero degrees right now. Turn the thumb screw, move this out. Say I want 10 degrees. Tighten that back up. Now I can do a 10 degree cut. Quick demonstration, set this to 45 degrees. There's our cut. And you got some extras in the box here, your instruction manual. The extra measure there. All the tools that you need, and a couple of replacement parts. This is a really nice miter gauge, but given the cost, I'm not sure I'd buy it again. I mean, you can definitely get by with the miter gauge that comes with your table saw. You can even, you can even build a, a longer fence if you need it. But I will recommend it. It's a very nice, well-made product. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button.